Number three on the list, or number four. How about this? What if I said, um, hey, how about, how about I do this? You're calling about a new Suburban we just got in. If, if it's okay by you, I'll call you back. Do you have an iPhone? Okay, I'll call you back and we'll FaceTime and I'll give you a walk around on that vehicle. Now here's what I know from experience. Most customers won't do that, but the fact that you're offering to do it means you're willing to go the extra mile. Mm -hmm. You're willing to do something that most people aren't. Or I could say, look, why don't I shoot a video of it and email it to you or text it to you. Okay, that way um, I'll give you a close-up view of the vehicle. I know you've seen pictures online, but I'll show you the actual vehicle. Cool? And if they say cool, fine. If they, if they say, well, no, no, you don't need to do that. Um, what were your times I could come in? 4.30 or 5.15. Mm -hmm. <coughs> do you ever offer to bring the vehicle to the customer? When you're trying to get an appointment? Instead of, in, I, I say, four, you know, 4.30 or 5.15, you go, well, neither one of those work. I say, well, how about this? How about I bring it to your place of work or your home and let you look at it there? Now, obviously, A, we need to be careful. B, if they live in Jackson, Tennessee, we're not going to do that. If they live... So how far would be too far? You know, I don't know exactly your traffic patterns here. I know in Atlanta, I wouldn't go any more than 10 miles, mm -hmm. okay? And, and it, it might be pretty much the same around here, or maybe it's only five miles, mm -hmm. okay? Again, both cities are dangerous cities, especially for a female, all right? Um, I would be careful, but here's the reality. Most customers are gonna say, well, no, 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 you don't need to do that. But what have you just done? Mm -hmm. You've offered to do something that most sales people don't offer. If they take you up on it too fast, I, that might be a red flag. Okay, I'd wanna know where they lived. I would wanna meet them in a very public place. I'd wanna meet them in a police station, mm -hmm. okay? But if it sells you a car and, and you live through it, right. <laughs> um, that might be a good idea. But more so than anything else, the fact that you're offering, I think will make a difference, okay? <laughs> All right, um, I'm calling about a used car. Explain the reconditioning process to me. Not for sure. Okay. Almost all of your vehicles are Motor Trend certified, right? Your used vehicles? Right. Okay. Well, you called, you called about a Motor Trend certified vehicle. Let me tell you what it takes to become a Motor Trend certified vehicle. Number one, it has to pass a thorough inspection, not a safety inspection. We go through the vehicle with a fine tooth comb. Anything that doesn't pass, we have to fix or replace, which makes it a better vehicle. And because it's a better vehicle, we can add a six month, 7,500 mile warranty. We'll give you a select six package, which I'll go into some detail when you get here. But believe me, it gives you coverages that even new cars don't have. Plus we have a price guarantee and an exchange policy. Now, I got a four o'clock and a six o'clock. Which one works best for you? Four o'clock. <coughs> We're going to be seeing a lot of each other, aren't we? Yeah. <laughs> okay. Um, do you offer to send, on a used car, do you offer to send them a Carfax? Yeah. Yes. Okay, good. Um, do you offer to send them the inspe a copy of the inspection form or the uh, a repair order? Or do you have access to those? You yeah. know, I normally do it like um, we, when we're, when go, we're about to. Monash it, monash it. That's how I do it. They yeah. do the manager. I say, that's a good point because you, when you offer a customer, you know, the, the, how they will call it, customer feel, feel content of happening, you know, because they say, well, at least they did something. It's, right. Sure to manage right. Market, over know. the phone? I've never did it over the phone, but I do it while they're here. Yeah, I don't okay. Know. So yeah, if, not, not if they haven't, the if I'm trying to get an appointment, I don't offer that. I've never offered it. I didn't even think to do that. That's why Steve is alive. Thank okay. you. That's I'm why. happy you're alive. That's great. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> All right. Um, again, we want to be different yeah. on the phone because aren't most customers calling more than one store? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay. So if, if I'm offering to do a video showing, if I'm offering to bring the vehicle to you, if I'm offering to send you the uh, Carfax and the inspection form and the repair order, 
I'm doing more than most salespeople even know to do.